What's up, heroes? I got today the preview for Darling of the Franks, episode 16. That's what we're going to watch today. I'm going to react to it, give you my opinions on it, some thoughts, and then we're just going to talk about it, man. So um, I have the preview here in the bottom right. Last time I did the preview, I uh, didn't show the video and I did a timestamp, but this time I'm going to do a little bit different because I feel bad for mobile users. Um, obviously, if you're on mobile, it's hard to watch the preview and watch my reaction at the same time. Um, it's still a little hard on PC, but not like impossible. So what I'm gonna do in this video is about halfway through the reaction I'm gonna stop the whole video have a blank screen that will say like skip to X time after that Just skip to that time point. Um, I basically just need to divide the video up for copyright purposes um, And that way I won't have to do the timestamp, you know That's the alternative the alternative is I do the timestamp on the bottom and uh, you follow that But like I said, I'm doing this for mobile users that way everyone can kind of win in a sense So here we go. Let's uh, let's watch this video dude. It's gonna be sick. No subtitles yet, though. That's okay, though. Alright, Squad 13 is back together. Zero Two is back with Squad 13. That's good. Alright, we got a All right, it's looking like a slice of life episode, actually. I'm surprised. I'm kind of surprised. Oh, wait, wait. Maybe not. Maybe not. Everything's okay. All right. So this was definitely... This was definitely not the most high preview that I've seen for the show so far. But given what episode 15 was, um, I'm not surprised that this was like a little bit less hype. So... I theorized that episode 15 and 16 might be similar to how 13 and 14 were in the sense that it could be like part one and part two, but it looks like that's not going to happen. It looks like 16 is going to be its pretty much own standalone episode. Um, so, you know, not like 13 and 14 were officially part one and two, but they really felt like it. So I thought 15 and 16 might be the same, but yeah, it looks like we're getting a slice life episode. Um, I'm just going to kind of like skip through some of these images here. So we got Ichigo, we got squad 13 back in their little cottage house thing it's uh it's pretty cute look looks like zero two's happy dude her horns are also back like super small her nails aren't that long and uh it looks like her full red oni claxo form has been suppressed once again suppressed once again rip the reddit theory saying that the blue, uh, red oni was uh gonna be a thing now um those were you know I, I never really believed in those theories anyways because there was a basically someone on reddit posted that he was he thought that there was going to be you know that that zero two was going to be in the red oni form now because strelezio went, went red and uh his basis though was that we never saw zero two in the whole episode again after strelezio went red but I, I, it wasn't the case and i even commented on that guy's post um to be fair his theory was cool though but i commented on his theory saying like we did actually see zero two again though after the red strelezio appeared um we had that little little tiny one second clip of zero two Right before the giant hand showed up and her horns glowed, and uh, she was definitely like her fair complexion and everything. So that red oni thing was not the case. But his theory was cool, though, man. If we had the red oni, I would have been kind of happy to see that, I guess. But you know, we're only on episode 16. It's a 25 episode series. The red oni is basically going to be like the Super Saiyan Ultra Instinct of uh, Darling in the Franks. So you know, we got to save it till later. We'll probably see it. But let's not do it at episode 16, you know, it's still a little bit too early to go like full Red Oni Zero Two. I think, you know, we're gonna get like, I don't know, maybe Blue Oni Hero, Red Oni Zero Two, taking out Ape or something. Um, but, you know, Ape could be the good guys, but I don't, I, you know, I don't, I don't know if I want to just talk, to talk theories and rabbit holes with you guys right now. But, yeah, I guess why not? If you guys, you know, want to end the video, you're more than welcome to. I'm just gonna spout some nonsense right now. Like, I don't know, that'd be cool, dude, to see the Blue Oni and the Red Oni, like, Hero and Zero Two fighting Ape. But some people think ape are like not evil um but given what we've seen them do to the parasites and the whole like life on earth is such garbage right now like i think they're pretty evil man like ape already can like live in space why don't they just make like space colonies or something for the people i don't know maybe they need magma maybe the dude they probably do need magma so it's like there's a lot of references and stuff to like folklore too so I don't know. It's cool, dude. Like, a lot of German names with the Klaxosaur and whatnot. But, yeah, I'm just kind of rambling nonsense because I'm super hyped for this episode coming out on Saturday. Um, but I guess I'll end this video here. That way I can start making breakfast and whatnot. So thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this little preview. Um, 
Let's not end it on this guy, dude. I forget his name half the time. Let's get like some zero two in here. There we go. Cute little zero two. She looking all innocent again and whatnot. Let's get a close up on her face though. And we'll end it on that. That's Hero's face. Oh, there we go. There we go. Perfect. Perfect. All right, guys. There we go. Hit the like button. Show the love for Zero Two and for me too. But you know, come on. <laughs> okay, guys. Catch you next time. Thank you.